everyone. The day before the uh, snowstorm, I got the um, thin bales loaded up. This is the uh, enough feet for the next three days. So uh, we don't have to uh, deal with that uh, snow uh, right away. We just got it all done and then uh, um, clean it up and then uh, go and feed them again. And uh, we've got over here one, two, three bales. I'm gonna get them unwrapped, get them unwrapped and put them in a building. So uh, three days. Today is uh, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Uh, we just have to grab those three bales and uh, bring them out. And then I guess after that, it's uh, it's uh, cleaning up snow. So uh, well, that's uh, that's it. I'm gonna hook up the trailer and head down in the valley. Um, and then. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see over there. I have a whole bunch of deer coming already over there. They are against the big four feet. But I'm going to go all the way down in the valley. Makes it a lot better for them. And, uh, who knows how much wind we're going to get because uh, forecasting like 8 to 10 or 12 inches of snow and uh, if the wind starts blowing, um, I might not be able to get down there anymore after this unless uh, we get less than that. But uh, hook up the wagon and go. All right, see you guys later. Come on, guys. Let's go. Follow the feed wagon. Follow me. Some steaks while I was unwrapping those uh, uh, those bales, take the net trap off. They came so close that I could grab their horns. I mean, you always gotta watch, you know, because one wrong move and then uh, they'll kill you. But uh, gotta have some fun. All right, let's get them unwrapped and spread them. Whole gang right there, all coming. Looking at, uh, I think you can tell that I really like this kind of uh, village, uh, village, whatever you call it. Uh, we try to make it on the dry outside. It's a lot easier uh, to spread them. You know, you kind of like freeze up and you can get them apart. And, uh, I think it's also better for them. Yeah, it is like, this is a beautiful sight. Alright, uh, I'm going to show you something guys, exactly like this, uh, something like this happened a few years ago, I, uh, I usually uh, leave the uh, door open over there on the building, front and back when I drive down and I expect that the deer all follow me, today I did the same thing and uh, look at that, 
there's still a lot of deer. I'm already done down there spreading over fields, but I thought they all followed me, but they didn't. Only the female and one male, I think. But a few years ago, I did the same thing. And as I came back up here, I look over that way, I see three really huge snakes outside the fence. I couldn't believe it. They just walked over and walked through the building and uh, and out. I said, I just can't be. I mean, it's just, it's just nuts. But it happened, and uh, today is a reminder. I think I shouldn't do that. I should I shouldn't leave the door open because you never know. They'll walk over, and then that's it. Uh, unfortunately, those three snakes a few years ago, um, Nico and me tried to kind of you know herd them in, but they are not like cows, you know. And uh, I had no choice. I had to uh, I had to shoot them because I couldn't get them back in here. But, I mean, look at this, I, I, uh, I'm getting too comfortable again, I, you know, maybe it's me being lazy getting off the tractor and closing the gate, but I think I really have to stop doing this again, because uh, I, uh, I don't want that to happen again. Uh, those, those, uh, those three stakes, they were really, really big. done for the day. <clears throat> got them fed for the next three days. Got um, bales over here for the fourth day. So this way we don't have to fight out there. Clean them up because uh, of the snow coming. <clears throat> got them all in here. Got the snow blower there. All right, I'm out of nature. Bring it on. We are ready. All right, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Like always, be safe out there with this weather coming, whoever lives up here in the Northeast or Pennsylvania or further down South. Even my daughter lives down in Virginia um, and uh, it's snowing there already. So this is a pretty big storm. So be safe out there and uh, see you guys uh, in a few days. Bye.